I would have just assumed, you know, no way I would have gotten anything, so I, I wanted to thank you. No, we appreciate the growl and a problem with us yet. Now, Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Make a great night, folks. Don't take anything personal. Your truth is personal to you. Your own opinions and point of view reflect your own agreements and are personal to you. It's no one's truth but your own. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 38, NASDAQ is up 49, S&P is up 12 and a half. You get the ever ready bunny here, folks, in a big way. Pretty cool. Gold, gold contract down $3.60, trading at 1780 an ounce. We got silver down 25 cents, $23.17 an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck 61. $63.85 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10-year note, up five ticks, trading 134.10. The 30-year bond, up 24 at 165.24. And King Dollar, King Dollar broke a tie. It's up 404 ticks, 93.539. Euro at 116, yen at 109.79. The British pound at 136 to 1 U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877. 9276648. Give us a call, folks. Wonder what's going on in your world. Let's get these babies up. In the world of the SPs, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, it's been quite a day out here. There's no two ways about that. If we go take a look at the futures first, what you're gonna see. So you had Asia down last night, you had Europe down this morning. We were down good. You had the S SPs down to 43, 47. And they just said, see ya, don't want to be you. And the bottom line is that they got, went all the way from 43.47, and right now we're at 44.06. If we take a look at the SPY, what you're going to see out here, it's going to get intriguing because you have option expiration tomorrow. And, you know, the bottom line is that <laughs> when we talk about white light, what white light is, folks, is that you're buying options that expire tomorrow. And you can imagine... Uh, whoever was buying options at the lows out here today, that, that had to be, ooh, that was about as, in, about as good as you can get. In fact, let me pull up the NQs for a second. I got to see this. So if we pull up the NQs, the NQs had a low of 710, and you're 250 points above that. And if we take a look at it, yeah, they, they broke all the lows, man. That's the bottom line. You broke all the lows for sure, and then you just took off like a rocket ship. Now, that being said, it looks to me that the way that we're actually set up here um, is that what you, what you do have is that this roll is happening, meaning I suspect what we're going to try to do now is that we're going to try to get to the uh, consolidation. Now, the, the consolidation inside the queues, the top of this 355, the low is 352, somewhere in there, because this is not, even though you made it all the way back up today, there's, there's a lot of volume, 36 million shares. Um, you know, we'll see how this baby shakes out, but that's what I'm looking at. If we take a look at the gold contract out here, what you have with the gold contract, gold contract trading down 390. It's amazing that gold's not really getting smoked, folks, because the bottom, and it's not getting smoked at all, uh, because of the fact that what the dollar is doing. Right now, the gold went down to 1774. You're at 1780. Uh, what you want to keep your eye on is this, and this is going to be intriguing, of course. Every Friday is well, every day is intriguing with gold, but uh, coming into a Friday is going to be a trip, no doubt. Uh, you don't need a lot of volume to get an ABC structure in the way up. 1797.50, 60 rather, is, is the B point. If you get 145,000, more than 145,000, you get ABC structure in the way up, and it's a monster one. It's 120 A to B equals C to D. Now, we go over to the dollar, we take a look at the dollar, bottom line inside the dollar. It's, uh, it's saying that, hey, man, it's going to be hard for this gold contract to go anywhere. Uh, we just broke the March highs. But that being said, the market's saying something. You know, I'm not quite, uh, well, the market, the market is saying that the dollar can get higher, and right now it doesn't matter. And I can tell you, on a short-term basis, that, that can work. On a not even on a longer-term basis, meaning a couple weeks, it doesn't work, folks. The bottom line is that where the dollar goes, 
gold goals, meaning you get a weaker dollar, the bottom line gold will go higher. You get a stronger dollar, gold goes lower. That's what it comes down to. So we get quite a market, no doubt. And I want to wish a great happy birthday to Ulti. So Ulti, right, you got to check this out. So this is, this is really cool. Ulti, folks, lives in Avion, France. Uh, he's a nephew of one of my business partners, and he's four years old. So Ulti, happy birthday, brother. Make it a great year out there. Wow! And best you're gonna have to teach him how to growl. Wow, wow, wow! I love it. <laughs> Let's go to Jose in Lakeland. Jose, what's going on, brother? Hey there, Tanya. Happy birthday, Opie, out there. Over Thank in you. Paris. Okay, so Cadence Design, right? Yeah, look, Tom, you said um, last week I heard you utter the words 180 on Cadence. Uh, were you drinking snops from under the desk? Is that for real? <laughs> well, let's see what we have here. So we pushed, yeah, this is why. We pushed into the swing with, with volume. We pull this on uh, monthly. Well, you can, let me just put them, my. So on a monthly, I'm trying to figure out, hey, let me get back to a weekly. I'm trying to figure out where I got the 180 from right now. One sec. Oh, I know what I did. Okay. So, yeah, you broke the consolidation. So the longer that it stays above 149, so what I, what I did, Jose, is this. When you break a consolidation, you take the top of the consolidation, 149. You take the bottom out here, which is 118. So we got what? That's, two, that's 20. What did I say, 49? Yeah. So you got, yeah, you get 30 bucks, and you add the 30 onto 150. That's where I got the 180. That's. Oh, I got you. I that, got that's you. How, okay. Yeah. Um, hey, Tom, uh, it looks like we're going to have, you, you got, look, the market's been down quite a bit over the last couple of weeks. You're going to have the, the usual annual good feeling rally going into uh, Labor Day, no doubt. You know, I'm glad you just brought that up because there's no doubt, man. That, they, yeah, there is. Labor Day, folks, is just like the 4th of July. I know. Yeah. Hey, listen, the, the market rejected a lower price out here today. I think we're in a consolidation that lower ends there. But you can see, you know, market-wise, I think it's going to be a slow roll, man. That's what I'm looking yeah, at. Yeah, Tom, 8 a.m. in Newmont are near the yearly lows. Look out. Yeah, look out below. Cooking, brother. <laughs> Have a great one, man. Have a safe one. Thank you.